It's the end of the year and you have probably had some lessons that came in your life and your business is here. Maybe they challenge you a bit or they challenge you a lot, but you learned something. Their purpose was to push you to grow and to get to the next level, but you can only get there if you get the lesson first. So what I want to do in this video is to share three powerful lessons I learned in business in 2018 that changed me. These three lessons are universal truths that can help you in your journey. Lesson number one, patiently detach from the outcome. You might want something to happen now, but you might need to put in a bit more work first before you're ready to receive it. Or there might be unforeseen circumstances beyond your control that cause delays. Or the way you want it to happen and insist for it to happen might not be beneficial for you and the obstacles or delays might be the universe's way of redirecting you somewhere better. The universe might be bringing you obstacles as a way of saying to you, stop, don't go there. I've got something better coming for you. If you don't have the patience and think that everything should happen at the time you want it to happen, with the people you want it to happen, you will always end up unsatisfied and disappointed because there are always situations that you can't control. And you will probably end up pushing for things to happen that might prove to be bad choices made in a hurry. You can only do your best effort every single hour of every single day and then patiently detach from the outcome and let the universe align the right situations and the right people. When it's right, it will feel right. One quote that I love from Dr. Wayne Dyer on this is that infinite patience produces immediate results. When you learn to patiently detach from the outcome and trust while you put in the work, things tend to happen faster and life becomes much easier. You're also more in tune with your intuition rather than being under stress and pushing for things to happen. So with patience, you can gain more clarity and make better decisions. Lesson number two, when you change the way you look at things, the things you look at change. There is more than enough all around you if you just open your eyes to it. You might think that there is not enough, the economy is not good, the country you live in is not right. However, that's just a mindset that you probably inherited from the beliefs of society and the culture that surrounds you. If you change your perspective and get into an abundance mindset, which means there is more than enough of what you want all around you and really feel that, opportunity will present itself to you from everywhere, even from the same place where you were before, but you thought you were limited. And lesson number three, your team can make you or break you as your business grows. You cannot grow a business on your own. You need skilled, committed people around you who have the right attitude to help your business grow. The people you hire will play a very important role in your success or failure. So you need to develop the right company culture, processes and values and not let people into your business unless they fit the profile of the person who can work with the culture, the mindset and the values of your business and is willing to follow the processes you put together and put in the work. You also need to be strong to let people who don't fit into your business go and create space for you. So now it's your time. What lessons have you learned in life and business in 2018 that helped you grow? Please share with us in the comments below to help and inspire others. This is Pavlina Babaluga, founder of Awakened Space Education, coach and speaker. And if you have enjoyed this video, make sure you stay in touch by following my page and subscribing. And I will be there to help you make your next one year your best one yet through my videos, live events, mentoring, inspiration and education. Let's enjoy the journey together because it's not only about the goal, it's about enjoying the journey to get there.